hello friends welcome to my new video in this video we will see what is casting process and see the different types of casting processes casting is the process of producing complex and desired shapes by pouring the molten matter into the molds and the final product is obtained after the solidification of the molten metal this process is the cheapest process as compared to the other manufacturing processes but it consumes more time now we will see the types of the casting processes now we will move towards the types of casting processes casting processes are mainly of two types expandable mold casting and permanent mold casting in expandable mold casting the molds must be destroyed to remove the casted product these molds are generally prepared by using sand plaster and ceramics then we will see the second type that is permanent mold casting in the permanent mold casting the molds can be used many times to produce the component in in this permanent mold casting the mold material are metals now we will move towards the types of the expandable mold casting first is sand casting it is the most widely used process in this process the molds are prepared by using sand and these molds can be used to produce complex complex parts in this process large variety of complex products can be produced this is the cheapest casting process among all the casting processes now we will see the second casting process that is investment casting process this casting process is used to produce precise products which will help to reduce wastage of material energy and repeated machining it can also be used to produce complex parts and produce many components at a single time in this process the patterns are prepared with the help of wax now we will move towards the types of the permanent mold casting the first type of the permanent mold casting is the gravity die casting these die casting processes are used to cast the products which are prepared by non ferrous alloys in this gravity die casting a mold is prepared with the help of two pieces of metals and these two pieces are clamped together to form the mold and then the molten matter metal is poured in the mold and no other external force is applied while pouring the metal only the gravitational pull is used to fill the metal in the mold and after the solidification of the metal the mold pieces are declamped or separated and after this the final component is removed from the die this gravity die casting has high very high surface finish now we will see the second type which is pressure die casting this pressure die casting has two sub types hot chamber die casting and cold chamber die casting in the hot chamber die casting the metals with low melting point are casted in this hot chamber die casting a furnace is attached for heating and melting the metal 
this low melting point materials are lead tin and zinc a external plunger is used to force the liquid metals into the molds then we will see the second subtype of the pressure die casting that is cold chamber die casting high in this method high melting point metals are used in this the molten metal is uh, brought from the external furnace and poured in the molds this pro this cold chamber die casting does not have inbuilt furnace like hot chamber die casting and a external force exerted by a plunger is used to force the liquid metal in the mold in this the material used are aluminium copper brass etc the applications of the pressure die castings are crankcase wall valve bodies parts of the injection pumps etc now we will see the third type of the permanent mold casting that is centrifugal casting it is the process of casting in which molds are rotated at high speed so due to this centrifugal force is created and the molten metal is forced outwards towards the die then we will see the four type of the permanent mold casting in this casting process the operation of pouring solidification and withdrawal of casting is carried out continuously in this process the molds are made up of copper or graphite and the molds are open at the bottom end to produce the castings continuously and convert the molten metal in the solid metal bar thanks for watching this video and if you enjoyed this video then like my video and subscribe my channel